Hey guys, welcome to Milgat Farms. We appreciate you taking time to watch our videos. Today is a short video on how to repair a lamp. This is a lamp that we have over at our cabin and it is broken. So this thing will keep twisting and it won't, it just won't work. So we're gonna replace this guy right here with a part that we got from Lowe's. Here, I'll put it up here. There you go. So we're gonna replace this part here and see if we can get this lamp working. You know, I, I bought these lamps a long time ago. I like them. They look like they've got some, I don't know, it's porcelain, and it looks like to be a brass or a bronze here. Pretty heavy, stout. Um, I put new lampshades on them. And if we took the lampshade off, we'll get that off the back on in a few minutes. So check it out. It's going to be a pretty easy fix, I believe. So guys, we got our tools, a Phillips head, a flathead, and possibly some cutters. So we're going to lay this puppy on its side, right here. Use something here to just kind of hold it up. Pull these guys off. Let's pull the bulb out first so we don't break it. There's that. This simply screws off, so it's pretty simple. I say that. Okay, we'll pull that out. All right, now, here we go. There, so that's out. You can see that thing just keeps on turning. I'm surprised it still works. It's, God, this thing's probably got to be 30, 40 years old. Back then, they put some tin right there. Somebody soldered tin on it. That's, that was good thinking, good engineering. All right, so we got to unscrew this guy. Okay, now let's pull this guy out of our package. Couple little pieces, parts here and there. And we're gonna go in reverse. We're gonna put this thing right here on. We'll start with that. Screw it on. That way we don't have to try to unwind it or wind it on after we put the, um, the wires together. Let me see, here we, God, that's on there pretty good. To make sure it's gonna stay, Phillips head screwdriver right here, okay? And the cost of this part right here, guys, wasn't very much. It was probably seven, eight bucks, which is a lot cheaper than buying a new lamp. You can see this thing slides right out. Pretty simple. This one's got three leads on it. I dropped one of the screws. Um, but we're only gonna use two, because that's all the wires we have. So we want to put it back on so that when we're twisting, it runs it in this direction and winds itself up a little bit. We don't want to take it off. Phillips head screwdriver. There's that one. Spin it and do the other one. Okay, that's about it right there, guys. We're gonna pull this cord from the bottom. There you go, see it going in? So we're all the way over on the bottom, yanking on that cord a little bit. Now, all we're gonna do, push this guy in. Can't be that simple, right? Oops, I heard a click. I think that's it. All right, I'll rotate this over so you guys can see it. Screw that thing down until you hear it start turning. There you go. And the switch is working. <clears throat> now we got it, well we still got it down. I'm gonna open this up just, I should have done this before. Open this up just a little bit. Okay, now we're gonna put our lampshade holder back on. stand to make a little modification to it, but I think these are going to slide right over and hold it. It's been holding it for a while. That piece hasn't changed. There you go. So we got them on. Next, light bulb. All right. 
And that's pretty much it. Here's our cool lampshade. Why that does that? Here we go. Plug it in, see? Well, that didn't work, did it? That's a problem. Hmm. All right, we did something wrong. <laughs> That's pretty much it. Hey guys, let's plug this thing in and see if it's gonna work. Oh, it did work. We just had it on already. Not a problem. Yay! Thanks a lot for watching our videos. If you guys like what you're seeing, give us a thumbs up. If you wanna visit the farm, it's millgatfarms.com. Hope you guys have a great day. Until next time, God bless you.